Welcome back to Coding Drift. In the previous video, we have seen how we can handle 404 pages in React Router. In this video, we will see nested routes. So what are nested routes and why do we need them? Let us say we have a dashboard page and inside that we have two to three links. Uh, let's say profile, orders and codes. If there are sub pages inside another page, then we will handle it using nested routes. So first I'll create the dashboard component. I'll have the class dashboard. Inside this, uh, I'll have three links. That is one to the profile page. We are ready to create these routes. I'll import the link component from React Router down. Similarly, I'll create uh, two more links. One is orders and one more is quotes. So let us quickly create these components. I just realized that I created it outside the components. So I will just move it inside. And inside components, I'll create profile, orders, and finally quotes. So I will add the dashboard route here. That is dashboard, and the component is dashboard. And I will add it to the nav link. we need to go to dashboard. So let's go ahead and see what has happened. So dashboard is added here. As you can see, the links are coming. The styling is not there. I'll just add some style. So what I'm doing here is I'm just aligning these links horizontally using flex and hiding the styles of the list. Now, if I click on any of the links, it will go to page not found because we haven't configured these routes. So let us go ahead and do that. Since this is nested route, which will come inside the dashboard, see the URL will be dashboard slash profile. We need to nest this route. So how do we nest this? I will not close that route here. I will have a separate tag closing that route. And inside this route, I will have another route that is path is equal to profile and element is equal to the profile component. I'll repeat this for other components, which is orders and quotes. Now let us go ahead and test and see if it works. So I clicked on profile. One thing you notice it is not going to 404 page as well. It is not displaying anything in profile orders or quotes. Why that is so? The reason why this occurs is because we are not telling where to render this profile orders or quotes component. So we need to tell the dashboard component where to render it. So this is where outlet comes into picture. So we need to display whatever the content of the current route below this nav bar. So after this UL, I will say outlet. I have imported outlet from React Router DOM. Now let us go back and see. So as you can see, profile orders and quotes is coming fine. So that is how nested routes work in React Router. In the next video, let us see what are index routes.